What's up, wrestling fans? Ratman Rich Fulmer, and this is your Man Report. The show where I bring to you independent talent and the companies and the moves that make them famous. <laughs> Growing up in Linden, New Jersey, Natalina Corvino was your typical girl. Quiet, shy, homebodied, bullied. That was until one day a senior, weighing about 200 plus pounds, picked on Natalina Corvino, made her angry, and <laughs> she picked this 200 pound senior up off the ground and slammed him to the floor. After that, this particular senior and all of her peers looked up to her, they called her She-Ra. That day changed her life. She started exercising, getting herself back into shape, decided to be a power lifter. Later on in life, she decided to be a pro wrestler. That was her calling. That was what she wanted to do. At age 35, she made her dream a reality. She started working for a professional wrestling company, PPW, Pure Pro Wrestling. You hear a lot of talk about paying your dues in the wrestling business. And Natalina Corvino definitely did that. She has worked everything from security to helping out setting up, cleaning up, tearing down, late nights in the gym, late nights in the wrestling ring, training, working hard on her on her power, her muscle, her skills, and eventually all that hard work paid off and the opportunities came for her to start doing a few spots. She trained harder in the ring, got more gym time in, and just over a year ago, from the time I'm making this right now, she made her dream to become a professional wrestler a reality by stepping foot in the ring for Pure Pro Wrestling. This lady wrestled everywhere from Pelham, North Carolina, to Buena Vista, Virginia, and every city in between. Nine cities to be exact. Pelham, Yanceyville, Havelock, Morrisville, Fayetteville, Concord, Montville, Vinton, and Buena Vista, all for pure pro wrestling. A year of hard work and even a harder training paid off when she won Diva of the Year in 2016. This made her want to push harder. Go the extra distance. Do the extra hour. It can't be bargained with. It can't be reasoned with. It doesn't feel pity or remorse or fear. And it absolutely will not stop. Ever. On November 26th, 2016, after a year of chasing the PPW women's title, her dream once again became a reality when she beat the then champion Casey Carlisle and won her first title. An emotional victory this was, both for herself, her husband, her fans, but I bet that 200 pound senior looks back and says, that lady beat my ass. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Nasty Nat herself, Natalina Corvino.
the tired of being sad. I am beautiful. Here I am.